Hi guys, Laughing House here. I uh, just wanted to bring you up to date on some uh, really nice development I've been working on for my controller. Uh, it involves basically controlling OFX, uh, something I've never thought possible because, as you know, uh, these type of controls work based on fixed screen positions. And if anything not fixed, it's OFX. So I've been looking into how could I detect positions on the screen, how could I detect what uh, all effects is, is loaded, etc. And I've come up with a crazy solution using dozens of open source tools and scripting and everything, but it's working so far flawless. So um, now working on packaging and rolling it out, but I, let, I want to make a short video to basically show you what's happening. So uh, I put it under one of the main sections, uh, key sections for key uh, modification, which I use, but not a lot. It's only a few things in there. So I thought, let's put something else on there. So when I press the AB button, it switches, as you can see on the pop-up window on the screen, into OFX mode. And I load up and I was OFX that I've configured. Let's say I pick a color compressor OFX and I press the detect OFX button and it detects the color compressor. And now it's configured to, to run this and I can find control uh, all the things here. Uh, if I want to set a target color for the compression, let's pick uh, red. I just put the mouse there and I press the button and it automatically picks up the color. And now I can uh, do the compression on, on, on red. And yeah, it's a, it's a great plugin by the way. But uh, So let's pick another one. Uh, let's pick uh, face refinement. Nice one. So detect, face refinement detected. Bang. So now I can do the tracking. Nothing much to track, but here we go. And now it's set up and I can do here the controls. Very fine details. I can switch functions here. Uh, let's pick another one. Let's pick mm, glow. I like glows. I like uh, red glows. So let's first detect them. Glow detected. And it's already picked red. So let's see, what can we do with it? Let's boost it a little bit. So threshold down, we got a beautiful red, very realistic glow. Um, but I don't like glow, so let's go pick something else. Let's pick a film grain. Film grain. So what grain shall we pick? Eight millimeter. I didn't put this on a button because there are a million options here. So it's a bit, yeah. uh, this is manual. So Select grain detected, and now I can contra control opacity of the grain and the, the texture and size and strength, etc. etc. So I think you uh, you get the idea. Um, I'm now working on how to package it because uh, installing all the open source stuff takes about one and a half hours and compiling and building. So I'm going to build a package to to make it easy to install. And then uh, for existing users, it's going to be a free upgrade, of course. Uh, lifetime upgrades are free for existing users. I have to think about what I'm going to do for new users. Maybe make two versions, one without OFX or win with, and make a separate prize, or just include everything in one. Uh, that's still up for gaps. But uh, so sorry for you guys with all the other controllers. You're going to be jealous. Um, OFX control. Bye-bye.